thing, so. Yeah, that'll be good. But on a quiet Saturday morning in the OSU Craft Center, art and science collide. It's more than a hobby, I would say, but it's not my like profession. But I, I, but I had to do art. Like, and when I was a high school student, I, I wanted to become a cartoonist. But my parents said, no. Song just submitted her final thesis in physics at Oregon State last week. She's not the only one who uses pottery as an outlet for creative expression. Ken, an OSU computer science graduate, says working with clay is an escape from his daily routine. Um, yeah, I work behind a computer all day and kind of just staring at a screen, working with numbers, and come here for a couple hours and it just kind of calms me, feel relaxed, kind of de-stresses. Sean is a Bachelor of Fine Arts, and his dream is to work with clay in a studio of his own someday. But this particular form of art is common ground with his wife. I'm married to a soil scientist, so she's all about dirt and clay and soil, and so me playing with clay kind of just rolls along with, uh, with, with her job as well. So we're both very earthy kind of creatures. Whether you're an earthy creature or a high-tech type, art and science are a perfect match at the OSU Craft Center. This is Molly Jones with Beaver News.